I just filled these two cans recently, so I know they don't need any more. But let's take a look anyway. Bunny monster! What are you doing in there? So we're gonna to need to go get feed for our animals today. The first thing I need to do is figure out how much feed we need to get. So I'm going to restock the feed that we've got stored in the chicken coop. And then we'll see from there how much we need. This is actually what we store our extra chicken food right next to the Mini Cooper in. So I'm gonna go ahead and fill this up while I'm in here. I usually like to empty out this garbage can that we're using to store the feed in. Every month or so, I'd say. Just so the, uh, just so the food on the bottom doesn't get old and uh, it's constantly fresher food for the chickens.
as you can imagine, this garbage can lid gets pretty disgusting. But uh, compared with the convenience of having the food right here, just being able to scoop it in for them every day, it's a fine trade-off. So we're actually just down to one extra bag of chicken food and one extra bag of rabbit food. So we're gonna need to get both of those as well as hay for the goats. The water and food is good right here for now. I don't have to refill these things every day. There's so few chickens over here in the Mini Cooper. Wendy feeds the rabbits, but because the feed comes in 50 pound bags, I'll usually fill up the cans that we keep out here near the rabbits for her. One bag will fill both cans. I just filled these two cans recently, so I know they don't need any more, but let's take a look anyway. Bunny monster, what are you doing in there? Sneaky bunny, sneaky bunny. <laughs> and she likes to stand so that her rump is on the wrong end. You know, so she's up higher than he needs to be. So that he can get up on higher ground, he might be okay. There you go. There you go, buddy. Get it. Get it. You're almost there. You're like this far away. <laughs> you can see Indigo's flagging a little bit. Yep. That's my brother over. She's clearly in. She's out there yelling. Striker! Don't let him do that. <laughs> There you go, get her there. <laughs> Come here, baby. Do you want to leave Indigo here while we go get the food? Okay. There are a number of choices for us in our area for getting animal food. We could go to Coastal Farm and Ranch or Wilco, but our favorite is Union Mills out in Molalla, Oregon. It takes us about an hour total to drive there, get the food and come back. So it's really not that inconvenient, but it would be nice if we had a better storage facility for our feed. So we wouldn't have to go quite as often as we do Hopefully that will be remedied in the future. But for right now, things are working pretty well. We can fit all of this in my van in one trip, so, uh, so that's good.
Okay, Rebbe. <clears throat> Be quiet in there. Get ready for your big reveal. <laughs>